welcome everybody and happy birthday to Winthrop today. Um, I, this is going to be very short, so we didn't know what the weather would be. We got no rain, that's good. Um, and we will start with a reading from Sarah. Good morning and welcome. My name is Sarah Fuller. I'm the chair of the Winthrop Town Council. Priscilla Jenkins, our fellow councillor, thank you for organizing um, this event this morning and taking the lead on marking Winthrop's 250th anniversary. Um, thank you all for being here this morning. You know it's a chilly day. Thank you to Tiff Shaw and the AP English class. Uh, we appreciate your help this morning. Thank you to the Winthrop Police Department for letting us stage this event in this historic location in town. Whereas, Winthrop has been home to generations of families, farms, businesses, organizations, and a natural landscape and people that reflect the best that Maine has to offer, whereas a community's heritage and history should be recognized for all its elements as these have, have crafted the foundation for current times and future days, whereas Winthrop enjoys a high level of civic engagement, passing the history and traditions along to younger generations, appreciating our heritage and welcoming new people and endeavors that help our community usher in a bright and prosperous future. Whereas Winthrop was formally incorporated on April 26 in the year 1771 and has thrived through over two centuries of challenges and opportunities. Therefore, I, Sarah Fuller, Chair of Town Council of Winthrop, Maine, do hereby announce and proclaim to all citizens and set seal here to row that April 26, 2021 is the town's Sester Centennial and encourages all residents and visitors to celebrate and mark this 250th anniversary from now through the end of the year in positive ways with family, friends, or civic organizations and take steps to ensure that our community continues to flourish well into the future. Thank you. Good morning, everyone. I am filling in for State Representative Tavis Hassafus. I was probably not going to come today because I'm in committee right now. <laughs> but I would be remiss if I didn't come to celebrate our 250th birthday. I am a history buff. So before I present the sentiment to our town council chair, I just have to read a paragraph and it will make very good sense to you. This is from the history of Winthrop. Captain Francis Purley son of Jacob and Dolly Purley, was born in Newberry, Massachusetts, 9th of March, 1791. He married on March the 30th, married Titcomb, and lived in Newberry, Mass. a short time. In 1814, he came to Winthrop and succeeded his uncle Amos on the farm on Sturdivant Hill. Thence, he removed to a farm on the East Monmouth Road. He served two terms as a selectman and represented the town in the legislature in 1844. That farm on East Monmouth Road is mine. And so I follow in the footsteps of the first owner of the farm by serving in the legislature. And I'm proud to say that Winthrop helped make history because some of you and many others allowed me to become the first black lawmaker in the state of Maine to serve in both chambers of the legislature in the year 2021. And with that, State of Maine, be it known to all that we, the members of the Senate and House of Representatives, join in recognizing the town of Winthrop, which is celebrating its 250th anniversary. We extend to the citizens of Winthrop our congratulations and best wishes, and be it ordered that this official expression of sentiment be sent forthwith on behalf of the 130th legislature and the people of the state of Maine. Given this first day of April 2021 at the state capitol, Augusta, signed President of the Senate, Troy D. Jackson, Speaker of the House, Ryan Fecto, Secretary of the Senate, Derek Grant, Clerk of the House, Robert Hunt, introduced by Representative Tavis Rock Hassenfuss from Reedfield, co-sponsored by yours truly, Senator Craig Hickman from Kennebec. You're welcome. I hope you all have a great day. I'm going back to work. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you.
we have a few historical words. Thank you, Priscilla. Good morning. I am Linda Pratt, President of Winthrop Historical Society. I would like to welcome all of you to this very special celebration of Winthrop's 250th birthday. In 1771, the town was incorporated even before we became a nation. Winthrop is one of the oldest towns in Kennebec County. Winthrop's history is one of a robust and thriving community. It was a center of shopping and employment for several surrounding towns. The majority of businesses fell in one of four categories, agriculture, manufacturing, retail, and hospitality recreation. The, businesses, the business world in Winthrop has changed over the years. However, the hospitality, caring, and supporting of neighbors and visitors continues to be alive and well. Our schools maintain a high standard of curriculum, sports, the arts, and activities for its students. Many events are planned in recognition of Winthrop's special year. The Historical Society is having a grand opening in August for everyone to enjoy and share exhibits of Winthrop's history. The Historical Center will be a safe place to house the artifacts of the town's history from the past to the present to the future, for the community to learn about and enjoy their history. Thank you all. concludes our formal program. Um, hopefully the church bells will start ringing in a little a bit here and um, I just want to read the uh, a piece of the dedic a piece of the dedication in the 1971 history of Winthrop it, uh, from 1971 to 2071. It is our hope that Winthrop in 2071 will find life good in a clean and beautiful world, a world at peace. To that end, we dedicate our energies, and I would hope that we will here now rededicate our energies to, to uh, achieve that vision. Thank you very much.